You may notice that the wings on your snowplow might fall back while pushing snow. You're about to learn how to make adjustments to the pressure relief valves so the wings stay in place while pushing snow. Let's begin with the Power Plow Snowplow. Install a 3000 PSI gauge into the pressure test port or tee it into the base end of the hose cylinder for the side being tested. Next, turn RV1 or RV4 all the way in, depending on which side you're adjusting. Fully extend the wings and read the pressure at deadhead. Do not adjust the pump while it's running. Adjust RV1 or RV4 so the gauge reads 1700 plus or minus 50 PSI. The adjustment for the HDV V-plow will be different. There are two valves on the driver's side and two valves on the passenger side that control the pressure relief on the base ends of the cylinders. In this example, the driver's side won't hold the plow in the scoop position. It could be either the RV3 or RV4. Begin troubleshooting by turning the valves all the way in and then backing them out one and a quarter turns each. This is the default setting for these valves set at 4600 PSI. If the plow still won't hold position, it is suggested that the valves be taken out of the block and inspect both the valve pieces as well as the inside of the manifold. Well, those are the most common relief valve adjustments that are made in the field. We hope that this training module has helped you become more confident in your troubleshooting.